Coach Muses. How we doing, guys? So, Thursday, throwback Thursday. What I'm going to do tonight is uh, I've got the orb. And I've got a piece of round silicone that I'm going to put right down on the very center of the bottom. And hopefully it'll stay. Pat it in the bottom here. Hang on. Alright, so I want it pretty centered there. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to pour some resin in there. And I'm going to put some of these little rocks around that piece of silicone. And I'm going to pour just to the very top of the silicone. Just where, where it's barely over the top of it. And we're going to let it cure for just a little bit until it gets sticky enough. And when I was at Dollar Tree the other day, I found Nemo. And I also found Dory. Why can't I think of the turtle's name? I can't think of his name. Oh, hang on. It's on here. Squirt. I don't know why I couldn't think of his name. And I found Marlin. So what my goal is, we're going to start tonight with Nemo. And my goal is I'm going to make four of these. And I'm leaving, I'm putting the silicone in the bottom because I want to be able to take it out. And if you see here, let me take him out of the package. He is sitting on a little clear blue, almost a resin looking base. So what I'm going to do is when that gets tacky enough on top of there, I'm going to set this in there. And then I'm going to put a tea light candle when I demold it. And hopefully, it will light up blue. That's my thoughts. Uh, also, when this gets a little tackier, I've got some fake greenery stuff we're going to put in there. But if this idea works, we're going to actually, like I said, I'm going to do the whole set of them. So, we're going to start out here and we're going to pour some resin in the bottom. Need to bring it to me so I can look straight down on it. Alright. So. I'm going to pour just a little bit more. And then we're going to take some of these little stones. I can't see it, guys. I'm going to have to bring it to me for a minute, and I'll show you what I got. Hard to see around that silicone from here. From where I'm sitting... this works I'm gonna make four little lights I have some little bitty lights that like go underneath stuff like this all right see what we got here let me turn on this flash here so you guys can see See, I've got it around the, around the piece there in the center. And we're going to pour some more resin in there. Around the center. Got to bring it back, guys. Sorry.
Okay. I think this is perfect for what I need. Let me show you what we got here. See it there is just fairly over the top of that silicone piece. Spread these rocks around so they're even. Spread the stones around so they're even around it. All right. Scrape out what little bits left in here. And we're gonna put this in here. All right. So we're gonna let that cure until it gets good and tacky. We're gonna sit Nemo down in. We're gonna sit some greenery around him, and uh, we'll let it completely cure because I don't want him floating to the top because he's not stuck down all the way. When that almost completely cures, it's hard enough that he's not going anywhere. I'll we'll pour the rest of it. And then we'll be back for demold. Alright guys, we'll see you in a couple hours. Bye. Okay guys, so we got Nemo in here. And I put... It's a little plastic greenery. This here. I put a piece of this in there and I put a little shell in there. I mean, uh, sorry, a uh, plastic starfish. I don't know if this is going to work, guys. We're going to be able to get our silicone out. So I got my resin mixed up here. I also don't want to fill it all the way full because I want it to look like the top of it, like a fishbowl. And I feel like if it closes all the way, if I fill it all the way, it's too, too small at the top to actually look like a fishbowl. So I figure if I pour it about to right here, that's going to give it more of a fishbowl-esque <laughs> look. So, got my resin mixed up here. Very few bubbles. But if there's any, I'm not super worried because it is water. And if I need to, I will pour another layer. It just isn't enough. This isn't going to be enough. It's got to be covering Nemo. All right. I'm going to mix up some more resin right quick here, guys. And we'll be right back. Mix up some more resin here. All right, we'll be right back. Okay, guys, we're back. So we're going to go ahead and pour the rest of it in here. sure it covers Nemo all the way up and I don't think I did <laughs> I might need more See if I cover him up. Nope, I did not. I did not. I need to cover him up a little bit more. All right, guys, I'm gonna mix up just a tiny bit more. We'll pour it, and I'll be, we'll be back in a couple hours to demold. See you then, guys. Bye. Alright, guys. So, I'm back. Let's see here how it turned out. Well, 
He's not. I don't feel him poking through the top, so that's a good sign. All right. So I know this is a little difficult to get out. <laughs> oh, let's see now. Oh, goodness. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this out. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the silicone out. So the rocks went underneath my silicone here. I was afraid of that. Because the bottom was curved. It wasn't flat. It's not a thick layer though. Because I can feel the silicone right here. Get it where I can get it out. <laughs> I can feel it there. Alright, I'm going to put you guys on a pause. I'm going to get this scraped off the bottom here. If I can. I should be able to. I can see where it's at right here. So, we're going to do that. And we're going to see if we can... Light up Nemo. So, alright guys, we'll be back in just a minute. Alright guys, so I got it out. I gotta clean the edge up a little bit here, but it's out. And it holds this little candle, battery operated candle. And it sits in here, just like so. So, we're going to put this up in here. Alright, I'm going to bring you guys down, put you on pause, bring you down, and we're going to turn out the lights. We'll be right back. Alright guys, so here we are. So, I got the color changing light underneath him. <laughs> Isn't he cute? Isn't he cute? Nemo! He is adorable, guys. Very cute. Turn the flashback off here. So you can see him again. There he is with the blue. I don't have a clear one. I do, but it's it's different. No, actually, it's not clear either. That's color changing, too. I tried to find some clear ones the other day. Actually, let me put you guys on pause. I think I might have a clear light we can use. Hang on. Okay, yeah, so I put a white light under it. So we got him in here. A lot of bubbles. A whole lot of bubbles. But he's underwater, so I'm fine with that. 
So this is my Nemo, other Nemo, my Nemo, and uh, I've got a couple ideas what I'm going to do differently next time. There's my greenery in the back, there's my starfish. Yeah, I have a couple ideas what I'm going to do different next time. But uh, we have Dory, we have uh, Squirt, and we have Marlin. So... We are going to try again. Alright guys, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, well why not? Look. Look at Nemo's cute little face. You see that cute face on there? I think he needs to be liked. Alright guys. I hope everyone has a wonderful night. I hope your resin cures beautifully. I hope your craft projects turn out amazing. I hope you are happy, healthy, safe, and blessed. And I will see you guys tomorrow night.